And then it finally ends up saying, a person must know of and have faith in Jehovah, accept His Word, recognize the operation of His Spirit, the force, the force, repent and be baptized. When once a person has met these conditions, salvation is possible. So if you've done those things, you've got a chance. You're saying there's a chance. Then to the question, are you saved? He can give the truthful reply, yes, thus far I am saved. <laughs> thus, once you are in the way of salvation, the way of salvation, exert yourself to stay in it. You cannot earn salvation by works. What? I mean, aren't you glad God gave you a brain that like works logically? I mean, what have I just been reading you? Works, 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 works. You cannot earn salvation by works. Faith is what is needed. But you do need to exercise your faith by practical works that give proof of it. Did you see that? No, I'm going to read it again. It's so stupid. It's from their website. I mean, a person that doesn't even understand English wrote this. You cannot earn your salvation by works, but you do need to exercise your faith by practical works. <laughs> it's works. I mean, you all knew this. It's works. It's works. Turn to John 3.36. John 3.36. We're just talking about John 3.36 today and what a great verse it is. Look, he that believeth on the Son hath everlasting life. Amen. It's not a process. When you believe on the Son, look, you have to believe on the Son. Believe on the Son. Right. You have to trust totally in the Son. But you, then you hath it. You have it. You possess it now. It's yours in, in, at that present time. And it's everlasting. It's just works, folks. I mean, let me close with this. I'm starting to feel unoriginal at the end of these sermons. You know, it's works. Yeah. It's works. It's works. It always comes back to works because there's only two religions in the whole world. Works and the Gospel of Jesus Christ. That's it. Tell people that. Because they're confused out there. There's like... there's. 80 different Christian churches. How would I know which, is, which one is which? Well, do they teach works or not? There's only two religions in the whole world. That's it. It's works and that. So, you know, ask yourself this question, though. Why isn't there a cult? Think about this. Why isn't there a cult that pops up that teaches uh, salvation by, by grace through faith? Why, why isn't there one? But, I mean, think of it. If I wanted to be closer to the Bible, and I'm some wicked reprobate, and I wanted to be closer to the Bible and come up with a better counterfeit, why wouldn't I create a false god? And, I mean, just stay with me. Create a false god, but then teach salvation in that false god that's not of works and is only grace through faith. Why wouldn't I do that? I mean, it'd be a better counterfeit, right? I mean, remember that quote? You do, you do need to exercise your faith by practical works. Here's the answer why you'll never see that. You got it. I just heard it. Because we will tell you what those works are. You see? Because guess what? You will not find a list of works that you need to do to get to heaven in this book. So if you can convince people that it is of works, you get to make the rules. You have to come to us to get your kids to heaven. Infant baptism? Yeah. Control. That's it. You've got to walk through the doors of that building to get your kids to heaven and to get yourself to heaven. That's why you'll never see a cult that pops up that just teaches salvation by grace through faith. You'll never see it. Because it's about controlling people. And we're going out and we're telling people that, hey, you know what? Um, we'd love for you to come to church but if you're never going to come to church, let me at least show you how to get to heaven. Because getting to heaven has nothing to do with coming to my church. And if I wanted to make money, and I wanted to have you know, a big following and big publications and all this extra biblical stuff and make all kinds of scams and money, I, I wouldn't do well telling people that. 